Not all protests right now are happening on the streets. Here in this area of Dallas, it's become a popular place where artists use it as a haven where they can express their feelings about the world using paint and old buildings as canvases. And one mural that just popped up, this one right here, is inviting some provocative conversations about what's been top of mind for many of us this week. Please, please, I can't breathe. Please, man. It's one artist's interpretation of a moment that's rocking the country. Ugh. What do you want? I can't breathe. An horrific moment depicting an image of George Floyd lying face down with a halo over his head as the faceless image of a Minneapolis officer kneels on the man's neck. Theo Pontravelli is the artist who painted this provocative mural in what many call Dallas's Graffiti Park. This is becoming the norm. Uh, I don't want it to become the norm. I, I know like one image doesn't change it, uh, but the horrific video kind of sheds light on what's been happening for so many years. Pontravelli's image shows the officer's relaxed hand in his pocket, his badge intentionally smudged. He doesn't deserve to, to wear that badge. People passing by call it a strong statement. For people to be so vicious about human being lives, you know, we all bleed the same. Some say this mural captures many degrees of pain that need to be discussed. When will people finally get it? When, especially law enforcement, when will they finally get it that what's happening is something that's been going on for a long time and we're not blind to it. Yet the artists and people stopping by are hoping this piece inspires dialogue and perhaps some change. And this isn't the only mural right now that has people digging into some deep dialogue about some pretty tough issues in our country. I'll have more on that coming up at six. In Dallas, I'm Damon Fernandez.